As many of you may know, and as I have announced yesterday in the presence of the President of the Government, Mariano Rajoy, 2014 was a record year once again for international tourism. For despite of many, many challenges, political upheavals, economic challenges, health pandemics, natural disasters, world tourism grew in international tourism arrivals by 4.7% in 2014 to reach a new milestone today of 1,135,000,000, 1, 1,135 million tourists traveling the world in one single year. What a grand movement and what a grand change it is doing this to the world around us. The economist Joseph Schumpeter taught us an important lesson for innovation. Sometimes we forget this lesson. Schumpeter told us that innovation implies the creative destruction and recombination of all paradigms. We sometimes forget that innovation is not only advancing, it's also forgetting some things in the past, and that is sometimes difficult. Indeed, tourism has evolved and changed in the last decades. It has grown to be a key activity in the world, but it is just full it is yet to fulfill some of its promises. Promises to really become an instrument for sustainable development and democratic governance. Promises of being able to stand to perfect storms on the supply side, including energy, water, human capital, and natural resources. Promises of responding to the growing expectations of citizens. Es para mí un honor presentarles al ganador del undécimo premio Ulises de la OMT a la innovación. Como hemos visto, los finalistas son empresas que han desarrollado productos turísticos y programas que ejemplifican cómo el sector privado puede mejorar la competitividad del turismo y conducir al desarrollo de un turismo sostenible y responsable a través de la innovación. Felicito a todas las empresas por tomar la iniciativa para conseguir que el turismo sea cada día mejor.